Let's turn attention now to Ogun State, where the Minister of State, Petroleum Resources, in charge of gas, has paid a visit to the governor of Ogun State to assess the level of damage caused by the last uh, Saturday's gas explosion in Abiokuta. TVC News' Kazim Olowe reports, and then we'll return with business updates. In order to assess the level of damage caused by the last Saturday's gas tanker explosion at Itaoshi in Abeokuta, to sympathize with the family of the person who lost his life in the incident and to look at ways to prevent future occurrence, the Minister of State Petroleum Resources Gas has paid a visit to Ogun State. He appreciates the governor for his prompt intervention in addressing the situation by calming the nerves of the people despite the tense situation. He added that the federal government is committed to the promotion of usage of compressed natural gas and Ogo State is known as one of the states that has been promoting it. He also promised that the ministry is looking at the cause of the issue critically in order to prevent future occurrence. For the life that has been lost, yes, the federal government will collaborate with your government to see and uh, as well the, the sufferings of the people affected the area. Excellency, to avert further occurrence of uh, such incidences, I have come with the authority chief so that we look at what has happened critically so that we know how to address the issue. Abiodo on his part highlighted the level of damage caused by the incident to the community and residents but appreciates God that only one life was lost. He commended the minister for the visit and assured him of Ogun State's readiness to a promotion of the usage of compressed natural gas. He also emphasized the issue of safety in the movement of gas products and regulations. We are very worried about the environmental impact you know, that this um, uh, this would have cost and also um, worried about the perception immediately what we did was we um, shut down the company um, because we felt that it's important to first do that uh, conduct a safety audit uh, whilst you know investigations are ongoing so we can determine the immediate cause of what happened the governor also said Ogo State remains industrial capital and it would continue to work on things that will make the state safe for people to invest, work, live and enjoy. Kazimolowe, TVC News, Abe Okuta.